another movie review. Hey, what's up? Kyle here again. I'm here, we're here with my friend Doug, and we just got to see Annabelle. And um, I, I'm sorry I haven't been making too many videos lately. I've just been so busy with other things. And um, but we're here to do, uh, do a movie review on Annabelle. What do you think of it, Doug? Yeah, I, I liked it overall. It was, it, it, I was, you know, I really liked it. Yeah, it was actually more, yeah. surprisingly more scary than I, I imagined. Yeah. The tr I just thought it was going to be another one of those, you know, regular horror films, and, you know, yeah. just regular horror films. Another you mean, one of those. You mean like piece of shit? Yeah. Like just yeah. one of those regular, like another movie, another horror film that's just coming out. Yeah. And, and I didn't expect it to be this good. It well, it had, was, a, it had a lot of hype. It did, it, and it, it's. I was working in the theater, and a, and a lot of people were going to Annabelle, and, and they're like, "I'm like, is this movie that scary?" Before I saw it, though. Yeah. And now I can see the, what the big hype was about, like why it's packed and been sold out and mm -hmm. everything. All the tickets. And it was very hard for me to get in to, mm -hmm. to this too. I did like it. I did like The Conjuring a little more. Yeah, me too. But I still thought this was good. There, you know, it had of course yeah, it had its flaws, but um, I genuinely liked it. You know, it had its good jump out parts and stuff. Yeah. Yeah, do you want do you want me to tell it what, them what it's about? Yeah, sure. Well, it was about a a couple who um, who's the woman's pr the wife is pregnant mm -hmm. and she's gonna have a baby and they buy a doll this creepy doll that you know is comes down a doll but they buy it and it's just a normal doll and their house gets invaded by invaded by um two satanic cult members and one of them is the girl who is a girl whose name who's Annabelle. And um, she ends up trying to murder them, and they attack them, and she ends up dying. And when Annabelle dies, she she was holding the doll that they had. I, I can't remember why she got it, but she was holding Anna, the doll that they purchased. And and her when she was dying, her blood went into the her blood went into the went into the doll, and it, her it possess, her soul possessed the doll, so it became Annabelle. Yeah, and then it, then it has just like these demons come out. So Doug. What does this have to do with The Conjuring? Because I know they say in the previews, you know, uh, but this was before The Conjuring, and like... Yeah, it has to... Yeah, well, in The Conjuring, I remember Annabelle was in The Conjuring, the doll. Because yeah. they talk about... Oh yeah, they talk about another family who... Or the, these people who had the doll and it was possessed. Mm. But this movie talks more about... The, focuses on the doll. And, yeah, it and talks about the backstory about why... She's possessed by the the spirit of Annabelle. I did like The Conjuring a little more. Yeah, so yeah. This this was good too. This was very scary. It kind of reminded me of the Child's Play movies, the Chucky movies, with you know the same sense with the doll, you know. And oh, yeah. I love Chucky. The Child's Play movies are cl are classic. And but this was maybe a little scarier and more like more was going on. I think in this one, I did like Child's Play though. Those are great movies. I love those. those I like Child's favorites. Play. They didn't scare me though. No, but I, I do know. like them. I really liked them, you know, a lot, and I like this movie too. Mm. And um, it also kind of reminded me of the part in, in of Return Night of Living D Dummy Three and Goosebumps. Oh, yeah. You know when they when they uh get the spell and then they and then they like you know like, the, the you know Slappy comes alive. Yeah. yeah. Well, there's a lot of you know the the haunted doll um theme. Of, you know, is yeah. A popular horror. Yeah. Theme, so people like that the doll getting possessed. I don't or an evil doll coming to life. Yeah, I love stuff like that. I don't even, and this movie scared the hell out of me. I don't know. I screamed in the theater a few times, mm -hmm. and a lot, not too many movies scare me. This movie scared the hell out of me. Yeah, I thought, I, thought it was pretty, I thought it was pretty. But I mean, they had a lot like jump out. There was a jump. There was some jump out parts. Yeah, there was right. some jump out parts. Out of five being the best, Doug, what would you rate it? Out of five being the best, you know, I, it was really good. Um, it was. It had its flaws. Um, definitely had flaws. You know, some yeah. every movie has flaws. Um, I say, I guess around four, three and a half, four. Yeah, I would say four as well. You know, um, it's not something totally amazing, but it's a worth checking out movie. It's like no Evil Dead or The Shining, and we oh. love the fucking Evil Dead. Well, that's, the that's a whole another. That's a whole another story. That's that's, that's, that's Evil Those Dead. Are a different <laughs> mo a whole another different like movies. Yeah. But uh, I would give this a four out of five. It wasn't the greatest thing, but it actually was pretty. Uh, it's I would go check it out. It had it, it, some pretty good scare scenes. There were some scary scenes, yeah, and it was just really good, but, uh, four out of five. Anyway, though, guys, hope you the movie we did of Annabelle. Uh, thanks a lot for watching and subscribing. Definitely give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy these videos, and definitely go see Annabelle. And I'll be on, be on the lookout for more videos as well. I'm coming back to YouTube, so keep a lookout. Coming back. So peace out, home dog. Go see Annabelle.
peace.